Undercover video about Planned Parenthood's practices sparks an expanded investigation by the state of Texas, and now state lawmakers have scheduled a hearing on this issue. Let's get more info on that. Jack Fink live for us in Dallas with details on the hearing itself. Jack? Well, Doug, the state Senate's Health and Human Services Committee is going to be holding this hearing next week to make sure no state laws were broken. But women's groups tell me they do not procure fetal tissue, which is at the heart of this controversy here in Texas. Um, what would what would work for you? Don't lowball it. Okay. In its new undercover video, the pro-life group Center for Medical Progress shows its investigators and a Planned Parenthood representative discussing obtaining fetal tissue for a fee. It's, it's been years since I've talked about compensation, so let me just uh -huh. figure out what others are getting at. If this is in the ballpark, then it's fine. If it's yeah. still low, then we can talk about it. You would. I want a Lamborghini. <laughs> <laughs> I said I want a Lamborghini. In a statement, Planned Parenthood says, at this time, Planned Parenthood cannot confirm the authenticity of this tape, and nobody can tell exactly what was discussed because of the extremely heavy editing, the agenda of the activists who produced it, and the fact that the original footage has not been made available. Amy Haxtra Miller, the owner of Woman's Health, which operates in Fort Worth and two other Texas cities and four other states, says often women who have abortions ask if they can donate the fetal tissue because they want to do something good. But in Texas, Miller says it's not allowed. Um, most fetal tissue research is done um, out of state and that Texas has um, some laws forbidding the export of any um, human tissues out, out of state. And so it's not something we've ever um, pursued in Texas. Still after seeing the no, videos, I, those I who are pro-life are calling for action. These are inhumane things that Planned Parenthood should be held accountable for. And now they're trying to justify these things. There is no justification. And Planned Parenthood continues to deny it ever profited from tissue donation. Live in Dallas, Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.